So what's up guys? Pesta Games here. And a question that I've gotten quite a bit actually over the last couple of weeks and months is Am I going to get a PlayStation 4? And that's the topic of this commentary for today. Um This is a Blitz. Yeah, Blitz gameplay. And uh yeah, it's nothing that special. It's basically the best thing I got. I don't know in the last three hours that I recorded. <laughs> because I'm not not necessarily that good at the game. I'm still learning everything. I don't like this map. Um, I don't like a lot of the maps actually. Like they're tolerable, but they're not that great. I love how like I go to start recording and then my voice just like decides to die. Um, yeah. So the PlayStation 4. Now, as you guys should have figured out by now, and I hope you figured out by now, I play all my games on PlayStation 3 and on the Wii. And, you know, I'm basically a Nintendo and Sony fanboy, I guess. It's not that I don't have anything against Microsoft, per se. I just don't care about their consoles. Um... I don't care about a first-person shooter machine, and I don't care that they have, well, I do kind of care that they have better online, but what are you going to do? Um, can't fix that. Oh well. So, PlayStation 4. Now, yes, I am going to get a PlayStation 4. No, I will not be getting it anywhere near launch. There are a couple reasons for this. One, I have other things to spend my money on. And all the money that I would have spent on video games and stuff, I've spent in the last couple of months on Ghosts, which you're watching, um, and Pokemon X, which I am a huge Pokemon fan, so that's, that's where a lot of that money went. Um... And the rest is all for gifts for people for, you know, Christmas. And, um... That's basically where that stands. Um, so, no. No, I will not be having a PlayStation 4 for quite some time. And... I mean, you know, that's what it is. However, I will be getting one eventually. Now, I got a PlayStation 3... I don't know... 2011? 2011. Yeah. So that was pretty late in the life cycle. PlayStation 3 came out in 2007. Or 6. Correct me if I'm wrong. I know you guys will. Um, oh, look at that nice, nice ass rocket. Man, that was good. Um, that is the only time that I ever really had a good time with the Trinity, with the Trinity missile. It, uh, I don't like it. I don't like it at all, but um, it's not like a Predator missile. It doesn't move the way you want it to. <laughs> Excuse me. Anyway, so... Yeah, I'm not going to be getting a PlayStation 4 for quite some time, and no, I will not be getting a 360 or an Xbox One. The next console that I will spend any sort of money on will be a Wii U. And... That is because I absolutely love Nintendo games, and I want Smash Brothers. And if you have been a part of this channel for quite some time, I'm sure you guys realize that I play Smash Brothers. Smash Brothers, I will be getting it on the 3DS probably first when it comes out, because it will come out for both platforms. But eventually I will get a Wii U version. And a Wii. You. So, don't have any doubt in that, the next console that I will buy, with my own money, will be a Wii U. Um, so, when will I get a PS4? I don't know. Couple years? Probably. So, as long as they keep bringing Call of Duty 
to PlayStation 3, I will continue to play Call of Duty on PlayStation 3. Oh, come on. Um, I don't see why they wouldn't, because I know the consoles, there's probably only going to be about a million consoles, maybe two million at most, in the next year or so. So, Activision and Infinity Ward will never give up money that they can have in their pockets. Okay, There's no way in hell. There's no chance. Anyone? They will cater to the, the 80 way, million voice, right? consoles of PlayStation 3 and the 80 million of the Xbox 360s are that are out there. They will create a Call of Duty for those consoles. There's no reason for them not to, there's no economic reason for them not to, and there's no chance in hell that they won't. So, that's just a little pro tip from someone that actually follows the games industry. Not as much as I should, but or not as much as I have in the past, but a lot in the past. <laughs> Man, this cough. I don't know. But, um, oh yeah, and I just missed that guy jumping into the blitz. Like, I saw him, and then I didn't react fast enough to stop him. And then that guy. Um... Honestly, I don't even remember if this is a winning game or not. I think it is? Maybe? Question mark? I don't know. Um... <laughs> we were all kind of shocked by that guy, too. It was like, he didn't run into the blitz! He didn't score for them! It's like, wait, that's the support guy. That's that 11 kill streak on the support package that has the riot shield dude in it. Which I've never seen, and I'm surprised people use it. It's kind of funny, actually. Um, I might actually run that just for kind of shits and giggles. Um, and by the way, the assault streak in this game sucks. The best thing is the guard dog, by far. Everything else kind of just fucking sucks in comparison, and you shouldn't run it. Run specialist if you got the perks, or run support, because support is... You're going to level up faster anyway with support. So, yeah, don't waste don't waste your time with the fucking assault package. It's, it's shit. It really is. Um, unless you can streak together, like, 14 kills. Which then, if you can do that, I guess, go for the fucking Loki or whatever. Like, do it. I've never piloted it, but I'm sure that if I won a private match and decided to do it, I would. But I have no desire to do that, so... Whatever. Um... But yeah, back to the PlayStation 4. Um... I'm not gonna have it for a while. And you are way more likely to see... Um, videos based on Smash Brothers and Nintendo games at some point than you are to see... Um... I only got one kill with my Juggernaug, and then I get killed. Nice. Like, next-gen stuff, I guess. No, the Wii U is technically next-gen. I don't give a shit what anybody says. Um, it came out after the Wii. The Wii was part of last generation, PlayStation 3 and 360. Thus, in the time frame, it is part of the generation that we are in now. The PlayStation 4 and the Xbox One. That's just how generations work. If you don't like it... I don't fucking care. Don't count out Nintendo. Nintendo can never be counted out because they'll always make a buck. You wanna know why? Because people like me are gonna buy those games. Super Mario 3D World? Yeah, you got my money. Smash Brothers? Yeah, you have my money. Those games will get them money. Always have, and they always will. So, don't ever count out Nintendo. And, yeah, I don't know. So, sorry, I guess I turned this into a Nintendo love fest, but, um... No, I will get a PS4 eventually. I definitely won't get an Xbox, and at some point I'll have to upgrade to the next generation of consoles. So, yeah, it'll happen eventually. I can't tell you when. I have no idea when. Maybe when I hit the lottery. Here's hoping. Um... So yeah, this uh, gameplay still has a couple minutes on it, and I basically covered what I wanted to say. Um, it's just that, you know, 
PlayStation 4, no, I will not have it. If you do have it, tell me what it's about. Tell me. Show me. Like, tell me what's up. I want to I wanna know more about it. It sounds cool as hell. It sounds great. And it sounds like it would be a blast. But, uh, I don't have the money for it. So, if you got a PS4, cool. Tell me in the comment section. Tell me how it is. And if you don't got a PS4, or if you're choosing the Xbox, tell me. Tell me why. I don't know. Let's get a little debate going on in the comments section. And, uh, yeah, the new YouTube comments, get over them. They're alright. Whatever. Anyway, that's it for this commentary. That's it for the gameplay. Hope you enjoyed. Best of Games out.